Hello everyone, my name is Bo Alexander and I'm so glad that you're here. Every now and again, I like to venture outside of my usual rounds at Home Goods and HomeSense to source inspiration and see what cutting edge designs have hit the upscale home decor market. In today's video, we'll be going to three stores, Crate and Barrel, Pottery Barn, and Our House. We'll peruse around each to see which designer styles, trends, and decor elements to keep an eye on and gather ideas for furniture and decor accents to search for when shopping for our own unique spaces. If you're new to my channel, be sure to hit the subscribe button down below. Let me know if you enjoy videos like this by chatting me in the comments. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up so that I know you would like me to create more videos like this in the future. Also, be sure to follow me over on Instagram at BotoxNow for more day-to-day -day posts and inspiration. Let's jump right into it. Our first stop of the day on this inspiration tour is Crate and Barrel. If you haven't been before, it's a one-stop shop for contemporary and modern furniture, houseware, and home decor accents. Their transitional fall decor was front row and center with this tablescape in rusty colored, warm autumnal hues. Notice how the vintage incandescent bulb in the fixture above adds a copper tint and touch of character to the display. These Burry or Raffia style turkeys caught my eye. For $9.95 each, the smaller variation could adorn a holiday tabletop, mantle, or buffet with ease. If you followed my channel for some time, you'll know that I gravitate towards white marble kitchen accents and accessories. At $14.99 each, these salt cellars are functional, nice to look at, and wouldn't take up too much space on a kitchen countertop. I liked this Lazy Susan too, but found one that's just a few inches smaller across from World Market. That's a fifth of the price at $16.99. I noticed they had the same exact faux eucalyptus stem that I styled into a vase on my kitchen countertop in last weekend's Fall Decorate With Me video here at Crate and Barrel for $14.95 a stem. Luckily, I paid a third of that at Michael's a few weeks back, only $5 per stem for the same look. These minimalistic earthware vessels were beautifully arranged atop this table. This matte, dark green glazed Ingrid bowl was simple in shape and could easily function as a decorative fruit or display bowl, art piece, or even a planter. In all the busts I've sourced, never have I come across one in the image of Marie Antoinette. This artisan crafted resin stone reproduction by Hudson Grace was massive and stood at two and a half feet in height. This dramatic piece of home decor was rather steep in price at $725, but in comparison to what I found online, it's actually quite the steal. These quartz crystal votive candle holders were rather expensive too, ranging in price from $495 to $850. This is certainly a DIYable project, but can be purchased readily made on Etsy, Cherish, or Burke Decor for a fraction of the price. These Lauren looped candle holders are light, luxe, and add an air of sculptural presence. They are minimalistic in appearance, and the concrete-esque texture adds an artisanal flair. These candle holders could make an impactful statement on their own, or paired for a sleek interplay of shape and design. I saw this flint gray marble bowl and instantly fell in love. The varying gray and tan colored veining swirls throughout and both contrasts and complements this vessel's sleek and simple form. I have been seeing a slew of sculpturally styled chairs and sofas make their way across my screen when scrolling for inspiration on Instagram. This chair in the round circular calder chair was striking on its own but paired so well with the beautifully tailored and curvy Ruelle sofa. This tambour veneered Walton dining table and sideboard were extremely mid-century modern in design. The textured facade, rounded silhouettes, moody charcoal finish, and sharp lines evoked a level of streamlined sophistication. If I could ever bring myself to purchase an ivory-colored sofa, this would be it. The Le Corbe sofa is modern, minimalistic, and finished in contrast welting that lines both the arms and seatback cushions. Personally, I have a soft spot for the opulence of early 1930s Urbane Art Deco styled furniture, and this piece was a looker. 
The family of edge mirrors offered here at Crate and Barrel is extensive. These rounded rectangle, arched, circular, and capsule-shaped wall and floor mirrors are understated with a touch of modern elegance that will add an intriguing geometric display when hung in any room. As traditional as they may be, I appreciate the elegance and poise of a wingback parlor chair. This variation in particular was upholstered in a modern chenille striped fabric. At quick glance, it slightly mimicked the appearance of ornately patterned snakeskin and blended high-style furnishings with modern-day comfort. This tubular, contemporary-styled Williams chair is extremely playful in shape and design. This armchair serves as an artistic statement piece or focal point in any environment and is comfortable to sit in. At $1,199, this impressive chair was fashioned in collaboration with Leanne Ford to bring a cool and fashionable vibe to a space. It is also on back order through late January of 2021. Similarly, the Sculpt Chair offers an eye-catching architectural profile from any angle. This particular rusty color they've termed Spice was attractive in appearance, especially as a color pop against a more neutral or monochromatic color scheme. If you are a lover of geometric form and simplified lines, you will likely enjoy the simplistic beauty of this Bodil four-legged, prairie-style inspired floor lamp. A piece like this incorporates angularity and linear verticality through its slender iron legs, negative space, and contrasting white drum shade. This trifecta sideboard serves as both a media cabinet and a bar. It has a distinctive mid-century modern furniture design in a low-slung, clean-lined, and asymmetrical look. The round cabinet is outfitted with a sliding tambour door that will lend a vintage retro twist to any modern space. Next up on our inspiration tour is Pottery Barn. Like Crate and Barrel, Pottery Barn had their classic fall harvest decor prominently displayed in the storefront entryway. As you'll see, the aesthetic here is more artisanal, relaxed, and rustic. The warm, golden tone of these mustard yellow dried yarrow bundles added a whimsical and earthy bohemian element paired with these oversized natural pine cones. The variegated amber hues in these faux lace hydrangea clusters gave them a delicate textural and very realistic appearance. There were three stems in this bundle selling for $29.50, but again, I purchased stems from Michaels that were extremely similar in shades of sunset red and orange for $3.49 each. This dried okra pod base filler lent the appeal of autumnal abundance and natural beauty displayed in this decorative bowl. Yet another trendy boho chic styled accent to instantly add visual interest into your display. Candlestick holders can make all the difference in a room's decor. They are perfect for providing an additional artful accent, height to a table or mantle display, and decorative flair. At $30 plus dollars each, the price was steep. I definitely recommend sourcing similar styles at Home Goods or Marshalls. Our final stop on this inspiration tour is Our House. Our House embraces an eclectic aesthetic that features a sleek, of the moment European influence and dark industrial look. This leather safari chair is inspired by the lightweight, portable armchairs found in early travel guides and tents of wealthy tourists. They evoke a rugged sophistication and rustic, luxurious appeal. The Amelie Grand Mirror will give any space a luxe refresh with its ornate filigree detailing. Its arched, metallic frame is artfully decorated with floral and vine accents for a bold, vintage, French-inspired aesthetic. Similarly, this Faticcio chandelier is hand-molded by Italian artisans in an elegantly accentuated floral vine motif. Our house is known for their family of Petra tables. These tabletops are made from either the petrified wood of fossilized trees or century marble from remote regions of the Philippines. The naturally sourced materials are selected and mosaiced by hand to form these one-of-a-kind surfaces. This giant hanging centerpiece definitely grabbed my attention. It was filled with an assortment of dried florals spanning Ruscus, Hanging Amaranthus, Marcella, Nigella, Pompous Grass, and Bleached Fern. These robin wishbone dining chairs are fashioned in a simple and chic design that's practical and complements many decor styles and aesthetics. 
the frames are built by craftsmen and steam bent into the unique wishbone-like shape. This Tipton leather, hair-on-hide bench is sure to add incredible style wherever it is placed. This piece is glamorous, sophisticated, and mixes materials for a totally new take on seating. The furniture display in this room reminded me of Restoration Hardware. Though inherently, the design aesthetic of the two stores couldn't be more different as a majority of our house's furniture and accents have a more eclectic and artisanal globally inspired design. This dandelion chandelier resembles the fluffy, seeded, flowering plant after it has blossomed. The whimsical pendant beautifully twinkles and reflects the light that radiates from thousands of intricately placed glass crystal accents. The Aubrey four-tier chandelier, too, creates a dramatic ambiance in any setting. The crystal drops in this fixture hang from the iron cage above in varying lengths to create the illusion of movement. So that is it for this week's video, you guys. I hope that you continue to feel inspired while sourcing inspiration and decor to elevate your home in your own unique style. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that little bell so that you can be notified first for upcoming posts and videos. And until next time, bye.